thank you at Andrew Warner's mom, whatever. Hello there. For today's magic trick, I will need you to pick a number between one and five. Got it? Great. Now multiply that number by nine, and if there are two digits, add those two digits together. Now subtract five from that number. Now I'm telling you this because when I was five years old, I was diagnosed with wizardry. Doctors told my mom and me, I'm sorry it has to be this way. She only has 600 years left to live. Six years old, I started to transform the other children into jelly beans. I was six years old when I realized it's not okay to fight the other children. Eight years old, I started to transform the snow into dairy cream lizards. Eight years old, I realized that snow tastes like snow, no matter how hard you try. Twelve, I found that addiction is a lot like the way that candy is. Thirteen, I found that writing is a sexy canvas. Abracadabra became sacrilegious. I was religious about writing love poem potion songs. I am 18 years old now, and the wizard-like emotion in my mind has yet to be silenced. I would describe this disease as a travesty you see. It's pop culture, it's Pop-Tart. It's making love to a Pop-Tart, hoping to call it art. It's going underwater and being so fascinated your lungs might fall apart. It's having a love and hoping that you will never part. But it's imaginary. You wish that this was voodoo, Houdini, David Copperfield, now you see me, but it's reaching into a hat, expecting a rabbit, having nothing but your fingers soaked in the habit of reality instead. It's clicking your heels three times, watching horror movies to believe in some other form of life. It's praying, chanting, believing, maybe, 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 this time, there'll be some magic. Now, with your number, associate that to a letter. So, one goes with A, two goes with B, etc. Now that you have that letter associated to the first country that you can think of in your mind. Now, I'm telling you this because sometimes it's hard to believe in God or destiny or magic or miracles. And when the doctor spoke to me, he misdiagnosed me. He said I was diagnosed with wizardry, but instead I was actually diagnosed with trickery. But deception is a soft kind of chivalry. So I told the doctor that I am not naive, that I want to laugh like my lungs are made out of cloud. I want to scream and I want it to be loud. I want truth to taint my marriage ring. I want to bring the doctor to shame as I tell him this is not naive. This is the after fame a miracle. I want to tell the doctor that it's okay to believe. It's okay to believe. It's okay to believe in Denmark.